Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Juliet and this is my channel, Mama Tried. <laughs> Today I'm going to be cleaning out my daughter's closet and her dresser because she's about to be a year old and she's pretty much outgrowing everything overnight so I need to go through her closet, reorganize everything so that way I don't miss any clothes that maybe she outgrows before she wears them. I hate when that happens so I'm going to be just organizing, decluttering, and taking out all of the clothes that don't fit her anymore and put them away. So I just decided I'd bring you guys along with me. So this is the current state of her closet. So all of this stuff, she's outgrown. This, I wanted to make a newborn shadow box, which I need to get around to that. And then here are all of her clothes. There's a bunch of stuff up here. It just needs to be cleaned out. And her shoes are right here. These are pretty much the sh only shoes left that fit her. Some of them may not fit her. I don't know if these fit her anymore. I'm not even sure if her Nikes fit her anymore, but she's asleep right now and I'm not going to wake her up to try them on her. Luxie's being my little helper, aren't you? <laughs> so these are all of the clothes so far that Luxie has outgrown. Yeah, that's correct. Mm -hmm. I can't believe it. And I've already, I went through her closet, I want to say when she was six months old. Yeah, so uh, that's been within the past five months. And she still has all these clothes that I'm going through to make sure that none of them she's outgrown. And she's such a good helper, you can see. Be careful! So, these are swimsuits. We've got some vests and jackets over here. I still need to get through everything in her closet, but man, she's got a lot. <laughs> So these are all clothes that Luxie has outgrown in the past five months. You don't really think that it's that much until you see it <laughs> like this. Like I really don't know how many outfits are in there, how many pair of shoes are in there. I don't know what I should do. I had the same problem last time I was cleaning things out. And I promised myself I would just keep two gallon size Ziploc baggies full of things. But this is a lot of things. It's really hard to get rid of stuff from your little ones. 
but the more I get rid of, the more stuff I can get for her, right? <laughs> I mean, check out all these shoes. Look, look at all these shoes. And I mean, some of the cutest shoes you've ever seen in your life. Little holographic rainbow shoes that are bunnies. I mean, it's so cute. Her little black glitter shoes. Unicorn shoes. These are one of my favorites. Oh, these little boots. Oh my gosh, I can't deal. And the first shoes I ever, ever bought her are these little house shoes because they were just so stinking cute. I mean, look at them. They're just adorable. Flip flops she never even got to wear because quarantine. I mean, we didn't go anywhere, so she never wore them. I mean, so many precious things. So many precious things. And then those are all like burp cloths and things. This is what I have going on in her closet so far. This is how it was organized before pretty much. But I've got pants and leggings, shorts, regular onesies, t-shirts, um, fancier like halter jumpers and more dressy onesies then two pieces which are my favorite I mean so cute I don't think she's worn this one yet and I've got some like rompers two-piece outfits and then we have dresses gonna be her 4th of July dress. I mean there's so many cute ones. Swimsuits. This was my swimsuit when I was a baby. I just want to take a picture of her in it and honestly I think this is going to be way too small for her so I may not be able to do that. But and then a little swimsuit cover up. Some jackets that she probably will never get to wear. Again she wore them this winter. And then these are all like 18 month and up clothes. So, yep, it's all organized pretty well. The clothes are anyway. The rest of the closet could use some help, but I mean, it's not like it just looks messy. It's really not messy. My little helper is back. I've separated out all of the clothes that don't fit her anymore. I don't know how this one got missed, but that's a newborn little costume thing. Those are six month, three to six month, six to nine month, and nine month. And then those are things that I just cannot get rid of. Um, I still have to go through them again and make sure that there's nothing in here that I want to keep. but. I guess I'm just going to get rid of all of this, not her. I'm not going to get rid of you. You're too cute. So, yeah. And then those are all accessories. I still need to go through those and decide on the things that I'm keeping. Because it's really hard to get rid of baby shoes, man. They're so cute. They're so cute. You're so cute. You don't like that? Like a little baby boots. Oh my goodness, it's all so cute. So yeah. But I'm going to get rid of a lot of it. And then with the money, buy her next season of clothes. Because all of this is 12 month. And this tiny section over here is 18 month. So when she grows out of 12 month, we're going to be in trouble. <laughs> so yeah, I'm still getting there. It looks a lot better in here. So these are the things that we've decided to keep. The book Luxie put there and the shoes were organized, but you know, my helper helped. And then these are all the things that we're keeping. They just have sentimental value to them. Some of these little onesies, I mean, you can tell that they're worn out and that's because, well, she wore them a lot. They were our favorite. 
She wore this the first time we ever went to Florida. And this tiny little swimsuit. I mean, seriously, this is ridiculous. Look at this baby now. Look at the size difference. That's crazy. That's crazy. And then just some other outfits that I just really can't part with. So, yeah, those are all the things that we're keeping. I organized and folded all of these. So I guess I'm going to sell those to get more money to buy her clothes. <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's everything. Okay, so this is the after part of the video. All of these clothes are 12 months. Some are 9 to 12 that still fit her or they're big 9 months. So they still fit her. We're still keeping them. So these are all of those that fit her now. And then this is the little section of things that are too big for her still. And everything is organized. Like I said before, it doesn't look <laughs> that organized. But I promise it is. I know where everything is. And just like over here, these are some blankets, um, a baby wearing thing, I can't think right now, little hat, shoe boxes for her shoes, and this is like a tooth fairy book, and some other things, her newborn, like stuff that we took her home from, or stuff we took to the hospital, um, her like traveling bag, wipes, diapers. If you have kids, you get it. Box, a box for her hatch baby grow. And those are clothes that I've been keeping in that Pampers box that she's outgrown. Whenever I clean out her closet, I get out Ziploc bags and I write down the age she was and the size the clothes are and seal them up. And then those are just some extra diaper bags. These are her shoes currently. I should probably try these on because these might may not fit her right now. So yeah, this is what everything looks like. All right, everything is finally finished. Luxie's closet looks great. It's nice and organized. Now I have to get to getting rid of all of her clothes. <laughs> so everything is nice and clean and feels great. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more of my videos. Also, if you will follow me over on Instagram, my Instagram handle is at Mama Tried Official. And once again, thank you so much for watching and have an awesome day. Bye!